Good evening, peace and blessings, and a whole lot of love. God is hot, dear y'all. Story time. No, this is, a, I'm about to share, you know, I'm about to prepare for my colonoscopy. And to prepare for your colonoscopy, you cannot eat the day before. You have to be on strictly on a liquid diet because if you eat food, they will not be able to do the procedure. And taking that solution while you got solid food in your system is a no-go. So I've been on a liquid diet this morning, which I drank green tea, then I had water and I had some chicken I mean some um yeah chicken broth. Yeah some chicken broth and um that's all I put in my system. So I had to con I got home about five and I had to come home and miss this big damn bottle of solution. You just had to add lukewarm water to it and they mine came with a lemon pack and um I had to start taking it at Five o'clock, which I started taking at five fifteen, and so far I took three cups, drunk three cups of eight ounces. So you gotta drink three cup, you gotta drink eight ounces every fifteen minutes from five p.m. to seven p.m. Then I gotta not drink any liquids for the rest of the night. Get up at five thirty in the morning and drink the the rest of the solution. I gotta drink the eight ounces every fifteen minutes from five thirty and finish by eight because my procedure is to be done at twelve thirty. And what they're going to put me to sleep to do the procedure. Now, the thing about this solution, when they say it's going to clean out your systems, I'm going to be pooping and for the rest of the <laughs> damn night. Thank God that is not a lot of, I don't have a lot of uh, people that live with. It's just three females that live in this house, me and my two daughters. And I told my daughter, my youngest daughter, if you got to go to the bathroom, I suggest you get a bucket in because I'm going to be on that toilet emptying out my intestines. And, it, I mean, nobody wants to be pooping all damn night. And I hope I'm done by the time I got to go to my procedure. Thank God my daughter's driving me and I ain't going to be on the public transportation talking about, oh, I got to go to the bathroom. <laughs> that would not be cool. But um, let's see how it go. You know, I do take care of my body. I eat well. So I know everything is all right. But just the thought of having something go up your rear end. Even though I'm not going to pull it because I'm going to be asleep. Just a thought of it makes me freaking nervous and nauseous. Because ain't nothing made to be going in there. It's only made for shit to come out of it. Gotta go.